This is Dabu7, and we do have questions being raised here about the possibility of a cyber attack or something else going on here, as Reuters was reporting that several sources have confirmed that DHS employees in Washington were unable to access some of the agency's computer networks, and this all started roughly 5 a.m. yesterday morning. They're saying it's not immediately clear how widespread the issue was or how significant it is. And I want to remind folks, listen, whenever there's a real deal national security threat or anything big going down, you're going to be hard pressed to get any details. Okay. Regardless of the propaganda and everything else, the establishment controlled mainstream media wants to peddle out there. Real situations, you're hard pressed to get hardly any details about it. So the only information that they did put out is that employees began experiencing problems logging into the network and they're saying that it was related to them trying to get in with their PIV cards or their personal identification verification cards. This is used by federal workers and contractors to access certain areas and information systems within DHS and the government. They're saying at least four different buildings connected to DHS were affected including locations used by the U.S. Citizenship and Immigration Services. Now, another source is saying that the cards did not appear to be responsible for this. In DHS, their mouth shut, not saying anything in response to this, which is to be kind of expected in a situation like this. They're not saying anything else. They're probably wishing that just this first bit of information uh, didn't even get out there showing that there was an issue. Something happened. Now people are asking what happened, looking for answers, and they're not providing any. So at this point, all we know is that something has happened here in terms of DHS. Is it a cyber attack? Was it just some glitches? Well, we don't know. I'm not sure if they're even going to make a statement on it, but it's interesting to note that this is affecting the heart of one of their alphabet gangs and them being even able to access their systems. So, if I get any more information, I'll keep you guys posted with it. I'll leave a link below. Also, make sure you're following me on Dabu777. I will be live over there again today, and we will be covering everything going down with Standing Rock. Today is the day they're evicting them, and if anything pops off, we hope to have eyes and ears on the ground there to show everyone what is going on. So, I'll leave links below. Till next time, this has been Dabu7. Much love, y'all.